Good morning, Commissioners. Uh, I'm Ashley Wood. I am a member of the Alachua County Historical Commission and a lifelong uh, resident of Alachua County, actually multi-generational. And uh, we'll get our PowerPoint up and going here in a second. Hopefully it will change dramatically. So we'll give you both a reading and a few views of our historic community. Mr. Wood, if you want to pull that mic up just to beneath your voice, then we'll be able to get it a little bit better. There you go. Okay. Thank you. Uh, the community of Evanston, Florida is situated on the Alachua Marion County border south of Micanopy. Humans have inhabited the area in and around the Evanston community for thousands of years. The lands yield both projectile points and pottery shards from a number of different native populations. Within a half mile of the community center is an excavated Patano village where Hernando de Soto encountered and visited the Patano. The land where Evanston is located is part of the Spanish Arrodondo land grant of 1817. In 1849, Nehemiah Brush, a merchant from Baltimore, bought 4,000 acres of this land and in 1854 sold two sections to the Evans family of South Carolina. Captain William Drayton Evans had large land holdings here west of Orange Lake and bordering Marion County. The town was already populated by some inhabitants and grew after he gave the right of way for the Florida Southern Railroad in 1882. In that same year, the building that is the present community store and post office was built. Evans moved his family to the town in the 1880s and built the original Evans Wood home in 1886. The community once consisted of two additional stores, a schoolhouse, three churches, a blacksmith shop, two packing houses, and a grist mill. Until the 1890s freezes, citrus was a major industry. Agricultural crops and cattle were and are still raised here. In 1956, the depot was moved and the railroad discontinued passenger service. Freight service continued until the tracks were removed in 1982. The community park was established in 1909 by J.L. Wolfenden, W.P. Shuttleworth, and F.B. Hester and continues to serve as a pleasure to the residents. Many present-day residents of the town are direct descendants of the original white and black families who came to the area prior to and in the 1880s. In 1884, W.P. Shuttleworth built the Evanston Community Store of Hart Pine as a warehouse for the Micanopy merchants. It was bought by Joseph Wolfenden, who first operated it as a store. The post office was established in 1882 and in the early 1900s moved into this building. The present store sits 100 feet south of its original location, moved in 1956 because of road paving. Originally located across from the railroad depot, it was the meeting place then and now. Numerous owners managed the store through the turn of the century. In 1909, H.D. Wood and Robert Evans bought the store. The later partnership of F.W. Wood and P.C. Swink bought the store in 1934. This name is still indicated on the storefront. Fred Wood Sr. became postmaster of Evanston in 1934 and served for 44 years, longer than any other postmaster in Florida, still containing original post office boxes and equipment. This is one of the few remaining country store post offices and remains in operation six days of the week. The building has been the subject of many news, magazine, television, and web articles and stories. It has been used in movies and photographed by thousands of visitors. I thank you for the opportunity to learn just a little bit about Evanston, Florida, and I invite you always to come down and see the old store and visit with some of the folks. Incidentally, the issue of rural clusters is moving forward for the Evanston community, and I'm happy it's at the point where it is now. Thank you, Mr. Wood. Questions? Uh, appreciate that. Any questions, Commissioners? No, great <clears throat> presentation. Now, I just want to say these three-minute histories are truly one of the highlights of our meeting, so thank you for all the work that you put thank in. Thank you for doing this. We enjoy presenting them to you. Thank yeah. you. Aragon. Thank you, Mr. Wood.